Hey, LS11 Universe, it's Xander, and welcome back to Pokemon Platinum. Last time, we made our way through the final part of Victory Road and took down Barry one last time. Now, let me confirm that you're qualified to challenge the Pokemon League. So let us examine the gym badges you gathered from Sinnoh. Warburg City's Coal Badge. Eternity City's Forest Badge. Heart Home City's Relic Badge. Veilstone City's Cobble Badge. Pastoria City's Fen Badge. Conolave City's Mine Badge. Snowpoint City's Icicle Badge. Sunny Shore City's Beacon Badge. Very well. Trainer, you've indeed collected all of the gym badges of Sinnoh. Demonstrate the power that brought you here and go for glory. Here we go. Won't lie, I'm hella nervous for this. Just in case I have to restart. go. I'm gonna give War Slug the, uh, whoops. I'm gonna give War Slug the experience share. I think he needs it, or she needs it more, excuse me. Hello, welcome to the Pokemon League. I'm Aaron of the Elite Four. It's good to meet you. Oh, I should explain, I'm a huge fan of bug Pokemon. Bug Pokemon are nasty mean, and yet they're beautiful too. Would you like to know why I take on challenges here? It's because I want to become perfect, just like my bug Pokemon. Okay, let me take you then. Yeah, some of you may have thought I was gonna give him that voice. Nah. Starts with Yon Mega. Yon Mega is a very, very fast Pokemon. I should have gone for Aerial Ace. It's a bug flying type. As are most bug types, apparently, but it has speed boost! Which is great. I mean, it's good since I have fly. It missed me twice, but. Hopefully we can take it out in one shot. Yes! One down, four to go. This is definitely going to be Twitter's fight here. Drapion, we're going to keep battling. I believe this is a bug poison type. Not the biggest fan of Drapion. Mainly because it can be a run killer for me sometimes. Oh boy. You're kidding me! We're gonna hope we thaw out this turn, that'd be awesome. If not, I'm gonna have to use, uh, something to get out of this. Oh my god! War Slug, get out there, because I have no idea what else to do for Twitter in this scenario. I... it's weird. I used to freeze opponents all the time, and they never stayed frozen. And same with me, they just unfreeze the same turn. Since I've started Let's Playing, it's the Let's Play Curse. Um, since I've started Let's Playing, everything stays frozen all the time when it's my Pokemon. I really don't know what I'm doing here. War Slug's just kind of being a sacrificial lamb. If that makes any sense. Alright, Aaron. Oh! I'll use some of the other things. Yes, that might just mean that it doesn't heal up. But well, we're not gonna survive the arrow ice, so. Critical hit, too. How about that? First knockout for us at the league. Off to a great start. I know a lot of them have to do with my team. My team is not cut out for, uh, that's, that's the problem. I don't have much type coverage on the team. Like, yes, one team can cover, one member of the team can cover a certain Pokemon. We got the Pokemon Star after is made to take out right here, but... We got a nice heal.
Yeah, we'll let this hammer cross wear itself out on Brandon for now. That was a crit, wasn't it? No, surprisingly it wasn't. Well, first of several hyper potions being used tonight. But this Heracross has just opened itself wide up. Made itself wide open, excuse me. That's uh, horrible grammar on my part. But with uh, stats lowered by two, one Aerial Ace does the trick. So you now three of his to hour one, or hour two, excuse me. Vespa Quinn. I want this thing out of here as quickly as possible, because this thing can be very, very dangerous. His ace in the hole, if you will. Thank God we got it out of there. Worth all the recoil damage we just took. Caesar! Ah, oh, this is the downside. Mm. Steel types are a problem for me when they're dual types, and their dual type resists ground. Like Buck does. Because Caesar is only really weak to fire. He's about to do a full restore for 1 HP. It's not over yet. Illegal E4 cannot give up. Yeah, can illegal E4! Because I'm full restored. Damn you, Aaron. I prefer the Aaron that I know. Not of the game crumbs either. Aaron of the, uh... Well, I'll keep that to myself in case I ever decide to branch out with that one day. We'll see. Either way. He's down. He's out. One down. Three to go. Pouring it on. I will now concede defeat, but I think you came to see how great bug type Pokemon can be. Hope you realize what you're up against with the Pokemon League. Battling is a deep and complex affair. I lost with the most beautiful and toughest of the bug Pokemon. We lost because I wasn't good enough. That's it. Back to training camp. It's here for me. No, that's wrong. Anyway, go on through the next room. Three trainers are waiting for you. They're all tougher than me. Well, I kind of wonder how they determine that. How they determine which member of the Elite Four comes first. Okay, let's see. You gotta do some reviving and some healing. I'm not gonna do a Hyper Potion on Twitter or Walden right now. One, because I don't think they're gonna be very useful in this upcoming fight. And two, because they're not low enough health. They're still pretty close to full health. Well, well, you're quite the adorable trainer, but you also got spelling. Haha, <laughs> I'm Bertha. I have a performance for ground type Pokemon. Well, would you show this old lady how much you've learned? Alright, Bertha. Let's do this. A little bit nervous about this one. Ground is a pretty much all around weakness for my team. Start with Walden. Maybe this 
Assassin's in enough? Okay. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Hang in there. He's hanging there. He's hanging there. Hanging there. Hanging there. Hanging there. Hang That a girl Aries, you hung in there. That's well, that's one God of War's here doesn't miss. That's why it's one of my favorite Pokemon names here. That one was cool. You're kidding me. One HP. One. One. That is my awful luck sometimes, but at least she got her full restore out of the way. See, and I just started with Walden, it could have gone so much smoother. Goli score, yeah, we're gonna switch. The War Slug. War Slug is your big moment. I could have also switched into Rapid here, but the Fly Score Blade is flying in ground. So Ice would have done pretty well against it. But for now, that's also why I was worried because Fly Score, Fly Score is pretty fast, so I'd rather not risk that. Get a more Slug. I'm not gonna lie, I was fully prepared to see that she used another full restore. I some I was afraid she was gonna have a second one. Rapid, I'm just gonna hop that you're a little bit faster. Kinda like ground types are another problem for me, aren't they? Oh, Rapid survived that pretty well, so that's good. And so yeah, Glide Score. The Golem. Alright. Let's go into Walden. So I feel like I need to with a Golem. I'm gonna, I'm gonna set up. We're now probably slower than it, but hey, we were faster than it to begin with, it was kind of surprising. Ha, <laughs> that's not going to affect us at all, actually. That's good. Why does it have Fire Punch? Fortunately, we are somewhat resi- Oh my god, this is why I'm not allowed to open my mouth, isn't it? I think we made the right choice setting up right here here. Oh no, I didn't mean to hit oh no, I didn't mean to hit that. I accidentally hit curse again. Please survive, please survive, please survive. Damn it. What do I do? Yeah, I got no clue what to do, so for right now, Twitter's going out there, and I'm gonna revive this son of a gun. War Slug, the Slug of War. You're getting back in there. Full heal you. Slug of War. Uh, 
Alright, Red Barrier. Let's see what you got for this. Red Barrier is a really good Pokemon for to wear. Again, something I considered for the team at one point. But we also had two ground types for the team. And pretty much Walden, Twitter, Ares, and Warslug were always going to be on the team. Brandon and Rapid, they were the ones that were switched around a little bit. Oh my god, Warslug, you're the best. That is what you call pulling your weight, ladies and gents. Finally, hit out on. A lot of people, you might, probably counted Warslug out, didn't you? You probably thought Warslug's not going to do anything. Warslug's just a waste of space on your team. Well, Warslug's proving you wrong right now, isn't she? Warslug's saying, suck it. Get a Warslug, get a Warslug. Come on, Warslug. Come on. Come on. Ugh. Dear child, don't assume for an instant that you won. Oh. Perfect. Please. Make. My. Day. Dose. Child, I must say, that was most impressive. Your Pokemon believed in you and did their best to earn you the win. Even though I lost, I find myself with a grin. You're quite something, youngster. I like how you and your Pokemon earned the win by working as one. But that's what makes you so strong. <laughs> I think that you can go as far as you want. So, I'm going to split it in half. Thank you all for watching this episode of Pokemon Platinum. If you liked the video, leave me a like. Tell me in the comments down below what you're doing in the series so far, and of course, don't forget to subscribe. It's free, it's easy, and it really helps me out. I'll see you all tomorrow for the second half of the Elite Four. Xander out.